If you're like me, occasionally I get my PDI format for competitions wrong. Here's a great little action that's really quick and will get all the information as it should be and help you in future. Sometimes you forget to do part of the workflow. So I have produced here an action that will take you through the whole process and remind you of every step. To load the action, you need to open your actions palette and you'll find that up under window. And if it's not ticked, just click on it and the actions palette will come up. And my action is already in here loaded under Light Academy Shared Actions. When you download this, it will download this folder, so you will get these other actions included in here. And a few of these you will see on the downloads page with a link to the appropriate video. But some of these like Flatten and Flatness RGB and Soft R Filter are my own personal actions, so they won't be on there. Now to load the actions, go up to the little menu icon here, and you want to go down to Load Actions. Find where you've downloaded the action to, and then locate Light Academy Shared Actions. Click on that and then click on Open. That will bring this folder here into your Actions palette. It may be further down, so if you want to, you can just click on the folder and drag it anywhere you want. So as I said at the start, this is the action we want, PDI, and it will actually make it an sRGB file and it will title and resize it. So I have an image here ready to go. Let's click once on the action and then play selection. So first of all, what will come up, it will tell you to insert in the top two boxes, the title and the author. I've also put a note here because some club software won't allow certain characters. So just click on continue. You can then put your title, Double click on author and put your name in. And for most clubs, that's all you need to do. Click on OK. It will continue running and then we'll give you another prompt to insert your width and height in pixels. Again, I've put a little reminder in here that most clubs, certainly in the UK, are looking at around 1600 pixels width and 1200 height. And if you've got a square, then 1200 by 1200. But your club may be smaller or slightly larger, so go with what your club requires. As said here, set your own dimensions. So click on continue. Automatically, 1600 comes up as the width. So if you don't want 1600, if you're looking at a height of 1200, pop that in there. But obviously, this wouldn't work with the rectangular landscape. So let's take that back to 1600. Like I said, you don't need to worry about resolution. When you put pixels in with the width and height, that overwrites this pixels and inch resolution option. So just use these two inputs here. So we've got 1600, click on OK. And that's finished and ready to save. You can see down in the history here, we've got from open and it converts the profile to sRGB because I actually capture in Adobe RGB. There's your file info that went in and the final image size. So that's all ready for you to save as and then email over to your PDI secretary. Hopefully that will help you with future entries and stop you from forgetting any of those steps.